Offer current has been detected on your USB device. System will shut down after 15 seconds to protect your main board. So this custom PC have an offer current on the USB device or maybe the USB port. So let's fix this custom PC. First, I'm gonna unplug the power. And I'm going to disconnect this USB-C and USB-3 cable that is connected to the case and see if that will fix the problem. Disconnect that. This is the USB-C and this is the USB-3. There you go. Let's reconnect the power. Turn it back on. And let's see if the problem is fixed. Nope, the problem still there. All right, what else we can do now? There may be some there may be some USB header or USB connector on the motherboard. I think it's going to be behind this graphic card. So I'm going to take this graphic card out and see if there's any uh, USB connector that is connected to the motherboard. All right, let's see here. This is the HD audio. This is the uh, fan. This is the RGB. This is the power button. And yeah, I don't see any USB cable or USB uh, connector connected to the motherboard. So the problem, the problem, it is most likely the motherboard that is bad. Or, you know what? Let's see the USB. Oh, maybe this one? Maybe this is what's causing the problem. Huh. Let's see if there's any broken USB port. All the USB ports looks good. So I just removed this one right here. I don't know what is this. Maybe like the uh, keyboard or mouse um, wireless thing. I'm gonna put a small graphic card and test to see if this little USB is the cause of the problem. All right, let's see. Still, same problem. So yeah, the problem is on the motherboard. I'm gonna take it apart 
and see if I can fix this motherboard. Here is the motherboard. Alright, so on the motherboard, I left the CPU still installed on the motherboard. These two memory, small graphic card, and I also connected with my own power supply. And let's turn on this motherboard and see if the problem still exists. Let's turn on the motherboard. The motherboard is turned on. Still, same problem. Overcurrent means that there's a component on the motherboard that is taking a lot of current. When the component taking a lot of current, that component is overheating or burning hot. That is my theory. So I'm going to grab a thermal camera and see if there's any component on the motherboard that is overheating. And based on the error message, the component should be around the USB connector area or the USB area. Here is the thermal camera. And let's see if there's any burning components or overheating components on that motherboard. Let's turn on the motherboard. Boom. Oop. Do you see what I see? Right there. It is getting hot around there. Around here. This is the, the part that's overheating. All right, the motherboard is turned off. Let me turn on the motherboard one more time and see if we have any temperature changes. See that? The component around here, it's lighting up. So something around here. Let's see what's there. All right here. Huh, I think I see some discoloration right here. Alright, I'm gonna bring this to my desk and inspect it under the microscope and see if I can fix this motherboard. This is the motherboard and based on what we see on the thermal camera it seems like the heat is coming from around this area right here around here so let's check under the microscope and see if we can find the overheating component all right this is the usb3 connector And this is the USB-C connector. I think I see something here. This component right here, I don't know what is this. It looks like a chip or, I don't know. I don't know what kind of component is this. This component looks burnt. And also there's like a capacitor, I think. Right next to it, it looks discolored. Well, not that bad, but this one here it looks really burnt. Zoom in more, hopefully you can see it clearly. Yeah, this right here. Yeah, this one is burnt to crisp. Let's remove this burnt component and see if that will fix the problem.
All right, the burnt component is removed. I have no idea what kind of component is that, really. Um, I'm gonna get a donor motherboard and see if there's any components that looks like this burnt component right here, near, that is located near the um, USB-C port. I went through all this donor board inspect them under the microscope and I found the small components that looks like the one that is burned from this motherboard this one right here is very very tiny let's solder this one to the motherboard and see if that will fix the problem all right it's gonna be right here There you go, looks good. Let's test the motherboard and see if the problem is fixed or not. All right, so here's the motherboard connected to the small graphic card, power supply, and let's turn it on. Oops. All this work out. Let's turn it on. Got lights. It lights up. And let's see if we got anything on the monitor. CPU memory change, whatever. And let's see. Press F1. No, I don't have any keyboard. Huh. Oh, the motherboard reached start itself. It just turned off. And turned back on. It reached start by itself. Oh. Got Windows. Loading. There you go. Let me shut this down and turn it on one more time. Shut this down. Shuts down. The computer is completely shut down. Let's turn it on one more time and see if we have any problem with this motherboard. The fan spins. It lights up.
And there you go. I think the motherboard is fixed. Let me put everything back to the case and test it one more time. And let's see if we still have any problem with this. install this small USB thing let's see here all right here is the PC everything is assembled the front USB-C and the USB 3 uh, front panel is connected and let's turn it on There you go, no more error message. Straight to the windows. All right, let's test the front panel USB 3. This is the Windows 11 installation USB. Plug it in. There you go, the USB shows up. Unplug it and it's gone. Plug it into the other port right here. The USB shows up. Unplug this one and it's gone. Let's test the USB C port right here. I got the USB C dongle. Plug it in. And the USB-C works. Unplug it. And it's gone. And there you go. The PC is fixed.